We participated in the NFL Helmet Challenge, uh, gathered a, a group of industry experts around material science and simulation, um, and one of our primary partners in that program was Ford AM, uh, working on both 3D printed components and lattice development. So Zenith was founded in 2004 by a gentleman named Vin Ferrara. He was a quarterback at Harvard um, and he was watching sports and noticing concussions that were happening in professional sports and thought there had to be a better way to go about protecting athletes. And uh, Zenith initially started looking at the lower energy level impacts that uh, happen more frequently and are more likely to cause a concussion. While we've been using 3D printing for many years and prototyping, the materials just weren't able to hold up to the rigors of use on field or actual physical testing. During the project, we prototyped with a number of different 3D printing processes and materials and found that the TPU-01 from Ford AM uh, was both durable enough for our needs and provided fantastic performance benefits. Producing lattice parts in TPU-01 gave us the ability to produce parts that we couldn't otherwise manufacture, and at the same time, we could iterate very quickly so we could come up with new geometries, print and test them, and go through that process over and over again to really come up with a tailored geometry very quickly. In addition to additive manufacturing, we partnered with Ford AM on sim both simulation and lattice cell design. Uh, we were able to develop a novel lattice, lattice cell that was specifically engineered to provide a constant pressure resistance. Um, this allowed us to use that lattice to accommodate all different head shapes and sizes uh, within the helmet very comfortably. The result of the NFL Helmet Challenge was our new Orbit Helmet, uh, which was launched in 2024. Uh, it was ranked number one on both the offensive line and defensive line uh, position-specific testing standards, number two on the quarterback standard, and number two on the overall general purpose Partnering with AB Corp 3D has allowed us to meet our delivery goals by batching our helmet lattice builds and scaling up their production capability to meet our needs. We were able to start the production process immediately without the cost or time needed for traditional tooling. The future of additive manufacturing and sporting goods, I think we'll continue to see advancements in material response that can be engineered into the product structure. Removing weight where it's not needed and giving areas of higher or lower density cushioning and higher flexibility.